about that. It's like internet, internet. You know, it's great having, not only am I not a math teacher and it's not a TV show, it's an internet show. And when the internet blows, the internet blows. But yeah. it's great. We're back. We're back with We're you, back. Mr. Hilarious JD, the math teacher. What kind of math do you teach? Algebra and geometry. Oh, so the easy one. The easy one, yeah. That's good. Yeah. A plus B equals oh, C. Oh, can you say something algebra? Parallelogram. That's yeah. all I remember about geometry. I don't even my, know that. my geometry teacher had a speech impediment. Oh, geez. And he, <laughs> <laughs> and he would say, like, parallelogram. And we would just, like, laugh like crazy. Every, we'd make him say it all the time. What is that? <laughs> and what's that? Exactly. I know it's a square, but what else? Oh, my God, he said it again. Exactly. <laughs> he was so funny. I love that teacher. I'm um, sure he really remembers you fondly for he, insulting him all those years. No, he likes me. I was nice. I loved math up until I stopped taking it, and then I tried taking it, and I had to drop it. I did. We'll see if we can get him to get to come to this show right here. It's the What's Brooklyn going on? County Fair. Where's I believe that? I've been to this Are there pigs a couple in times. It's a, it's a show that I've been together for about four years now, Brooklyn County Fair. Oh, we, is that uh, a real county fair? It's, uh, no, it's more just a, a, a band showcasing thing we do. We have uh, four or five bands. We fill up a venue, and we just play all night. So uh, it's a lot of fun. And which band are you? I am in the Newton Gang. That's the CD. Is that like Apple Newton? Uh, it's more like the the brothers Newton. They were the most successful bank robbers of all time, and I took Is them that right? out. Yeah, they were they were like in their teens and early twenties, and they made millions and millions, and then they all got busted and still all lived to be into their sixties, eighties, and nineties. Like where? In Texas. This is all in Texas. prison. Uh, no, they they got out of prison and still Did lived. They, they were ranchers. Out of prison? No, they were like they were totally legitimately let go. They were ranchers and stuff. They towards the end of their lives, they made appearances on places like Johnny Carson. And stuff. Oh, Just today the living, is Johnny. I love Johnny Carson. Living Carson's. bank robbers and stuff. That was before three strikes, you're out. You were like a lot more likely to get hanged, but if That's you didn't true. get hanged, you were a lot more likely to get out of jail. And it legitimately was one strike. There was a lot of banks, but they only got busted the one time. Oh, so they only got busted for that but, one. But it was millions and millions of so on that, so, on so that, you guys wait, are the Newton wait. gang. Yeah. So, and they were from Texas? They were Texans, yep. And you got a whole bunch of other bands on this bill. This is Thursday the 28th. That's yeah. coming right up. That's yeah, next week. next Thursday. We got yeah. the CDs in yesterday, so we're excited. Oh, the, the Thursday the 28th. the Royal Wedding. And, you're, and, you're, and your CD's coming out, so this is your CD release as well. So is that the Bachelor well. Party? That's the CD release, and it is Prince William's Bachelor Party. Yeah, He's that's in our office. Yeah, yeah, totally. Where's it going to be? It says Southpaw. Thank you for asking. It says Southpaw. First time I've ever done a show at Southpaw. But we got uh, Don Flemons of the Carolina Chocolate Drops. He so had, should they hide the safe that night? The South. Oh, yeah, well, you know, you never know with me around. Well, the Newton gang is coming. Exactly. 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 We don't. We we now we we fight our battles with instruments. You know, kind of uh, more of a pedal steel instead of a bombardier. Oh wait a minute. That's right. And you're gonna play for us, aren't you? I could you? do that. Yeah, I'd love to. You're do not it. tuned up. Uh, I think I could be. That's pretty, yeah. Pretty close. You want to go grab your uh, weapon? Sure. Why not? All right. Let's hear. Let's hear this guy. I want to hear you play, Mr. Math Teacher, <laughs> Bank Robber. Yeah. <clears throat> algebra, geometry. Can you can you ask an al? Can you like do something in your head like algebra? Logarithm? Uh, can you do a logarithm? Well, I can make a fire out of them. I can totally make a fire out like of them. Like put the logs? Yeah. Totally. Yeah. I got it. Got to get a good base. What about his voice? You ready? I'm good. Oh, yeah. I mean, Should I don't even point it up like this. Fine. Yeah, I can, yeah, I can hit it. I'm pretty loud. All right, let's hear you, JD. Everybody ready? JD. Came on to my family's land. Shot my father to the ground. Took my mother and my sister. But I was in found. They lit the house flame. Watch the glue in the night. Carried all my arms to take. Headed out for first life. Day to day, right wrong. Day to day, right wrong. Boy heads out into the world all along. Day to day, right wrong. Slept out under the stars Years and years I'd roam 
never stop to find a place that I can call my home. Always searching for the man. Shot my daddy down. Then I'm pulsing through my veins when I can sense it work out. Day to day, right or wrong. Day to day, right or wrong. Boy becomes a man stuck out on the road. Day to day, right or wrong. Found a man one winter's night. Stop outside of old Mexico Between what I had What I had to do Pride began to show The first two fell before I blinked The last three hit the floor As I made my way I left the trail of blood the back room to the front door. Day to day, right or wrong. Day to day, right or wrong. Hide the pain inside, I play so strong. Day to day, right or wrong. Day to day, right or wrong. Day right on. Could not hide who I was all along. Either way, I don't belong. That's a little bit of a sad song. <laughs> Is that sad? It's a little bit of a sad song. What's it about? Um, well, it's basically just about a, a kid uh, getting stuck on his own when he lost his family, you know, and it was due to some people, kind of these outlaws, and it's a, kind of that idea. I've been to, doing like kind of the outlaw country music thing, and I got really into the, uh, the Highwaymen and some other bands uh, of the time, and I think... Um, I don't know. I just, I just, I wanted to write some song about somebody being stuck by themselves, and that was a character I had in mind. You know, I was talking to my parents recently. They said, "Why are all your songs so negative?" And, and every man, uh, you know, maternal and paternal figure is like this. And I, originally, I wanted to be a, a screenwriter and an actor. I'd gone to theater school, and all that. I just don't have the time or the patience to sit and write like an eighty-page or a hundred-page script. So you know, you write the story into like two or three solid nice. minutes, and you know. That's it. That's where the characters are. That's where the story is. I, I see it in my head. That's like, awesome. If I had years to make movies, I'd make movies. Well, you can the make songs. the video one day, maybe. maybe. Yeah, that might be fun, too. I just, I just, the songs come out, they're done, and it's a finished product, and I'm much more satisfied. Yeah, it's so really good. That's I, what they are. I, was, I like that, too, because if I jump in right here, because a lot of folks that write songs nowadays don't really think of them as stories or, you know, yeah. used to be there, you know, used to be a lot more narrative in songs. I mean, I like some crazy, you know, messed up stoner shit too, you know what I'm saying? But uh, it's kind of nice, you know, the old school songs, like they told a story, there was like a dynamic, there was like an arc to it and everything, you Beginning, know? Beginning, end, and middle. And yeah. I, I just think that lacks a lot, and that was just kind of a, an episodic song I ended up writing. I, my wife and I got a, a cabin in Maine, and I just, we, we didn't have any electricity in it, we just went to go sit and go With kayaking. the logarithms? Logarithms, and, and kayakisms, and, and lobster <laughs> trappingisms, and yeah. all kinds of, you know, trapezoids and stuff. That's and, uh, and in the end, I ended up with two songs, and they were both about people killing people, but, um... <laughs> <laughs> so, well, Maine does bring that and out. And you were stuck in the cabin so, with your wife for how long? Exactly, so don't, don't go lobster trapping and fishing with your wife with no electricity unless you want to write some good murder ballads. Um, nice. <laughs> That's cool. Well, you know, I'm sure that those um, and Newton the gang... lady is still with us, I take it? Oh, uh, yeah, she's around, I think. Um, know, yeah. See how the weekend treats it. And yeah. I'm sure the well, Newton we'll gang... We're looking forward to this you know, show. Yeah, but back to this Newton gang, they, they only got caught for bank robbery. You don't know what they did not get caught for. 
Well, they actually released a lot of their memoirs. So there, there's a full, I mean, there's a movie made about them. There's books about them. It's, it's interesting to just see how much was actually, they got away with That's it. what I'm saying. Yeah, I mean, so there, there could have been a murder in there that they didn't tell. That's true, that's true. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, and, you could be, you could be channeling them. I hope so. I, ho I think you are. Stories, you I know? think you are, Mr. Newton Yang, okay. J.D. All right. I'll take it. Yeah, I think you are. So how do people find you? Uh, I, I operate a website that was handed down to me from one of your other previous guests today, Mr. Uh, Uncle Leon. Nice. He started a site called brooklyncountry.com. What's that called again? Brooklyncountry.com. Brooklyn Country. It's all spelled yeah. out like B-R-O-O-K-L-Y-N-C-O-U-N-T-R-Y-Dot-Com. You remember? Oh, it was slash. We saw that was so funny. The dot is just the dot, but we once saw it with slash. Yeah, it was on Conan O'Brien. And they put a picture of slash there. Oh, nice. And then they had like the rest of the address. But you have no slash in there, right? No, no, we do have a dot. If you want to do, like dot matrix, you know. I always like to give a Joan Rivers uh, space ball shout wherever possible. I love uh, Joan Rivers. And the one guy who would get that joke laughing in the background. Is that Uncle Leon? Yes. Well, that's because he started the Brooklyn Country. He did. He started the Brooklyn website, Country site. So. And, uh, and I've taken it over since then and, and uh, have wow. a great webmaster. So you're like an incestual friend. family here. It's, yeah, it's all hillbilly. It's what you can do. We don't well, know. hillbilly, there you go. Castle. Yeah, when you don't have a castle, castle, you can do it all online. You know? I mean, that's how it works. Well, he's playing at the Prince's Bachelor Party, so yeah. it's all connected uh, here. It's, it's entertaining. You're releasing your Lines at the Prince's Bachelor Party. Yeah, wow, in that's Brooklyn. Cool, man. He's flying over for that night. Yeah, right? he's helipadding it over to South Park. It's good. I mean, that's you know, what you we do. We got the prince's endorsement. Royalty loves us. I love the. <laughs> yeah. I think it's all a bunch of fun, you know. I think so too. Exactly. So yes, yeah, so we got the we got the CD release, but we got the site that we promote all local. Now, do you have to be country? I call myself punk tree. No, I mean it's. I, again, I, I go, do. I go back to kind of what Leon had was it was it was why limit what country is when we're really trying to get a, a community built. So was, what do you do at this BrooklynCountry.com? Uh, I update it regularly whenever bands let me know that they exist and that they're playing in the scene. I put their stuff on the calendar. I have so they the tell you day. and then you do that. If I find them, I find them. But most of the time, a lot of bands are finding the site down to reaching out to us. So it's, nice. It's, it's so you can just be like Brooklyn Country. It it can just be Brooklyn. You just have to know that, that Brooklyn is a place and that country is a space and you yep. can be any kind of music person and come space there and the get listed. If you if you Google where can I find country music in New York, Brooklyn Country will pop up. And that's that's part of the thing is the site's getting more visible. We're, we're finding nice. a lot of bands. We're good. finding a lot of good shows. And uh, we're working with people like, again, you had another guest, uh, Laura Reveling. Yay. And, and they're promoting their shows and we're promoting ours. We cross promote. Well, uh, we're all into fun. that here on yeah. Ruin Who. We like partnering, crossing, bridges, tunnels, all that jazz with sure. all people of passion. So... Coney Island Cowboy, thank you for, yeah. for doing this with me today. Thank you, Ru. I hope you had You're a good a time. Lighter. Did you have fun? <clears throat> yes, I did. Excellent. Sure. And and I'll see you in a few weeks um, at mm -hmm. the other May spot. May 11th at, um, uh, at Otto's, Otto's Drunken Head, yes, I believe. Yes, because we're there every Wednesday. In the little borough of Manhattan. Every Wednesday we are at Otto's Drunken Head. and um, Most Wednesdays. Every Wednesday. Every Wednesday, oh. And some Fridays, we're here. Once a month, we are here in Brooklyn. This is our second Brooklyn edition. The next one is May 20th. Brooklyn. And the, 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 the dirty pillows are going to be here. And right. um, they're here right now. And it's going to just keep going. Um, May 20th is the next one here. Then June 17th are the two Fridays that we know. Every Wednesday at Autos. And um, thank you so much. We'll be back again and again, again and again.